What's up guys, my name is WhatsNight5 and I'm back again today with another video and now today is going to be a really quick video um, basically this is in response to a picture, a couple of pictures that I uploaded actually I'll post a link to that picture in the description um, basically yesterday, which was the 7th of December I posted two pictures of an X01 uh, suit of armour that I found just randomly out in the wild and the album that the two pictures are in have got over 160,000 views, I think, at this point. Um, and then the images, independently, the first one has got 340,000, and then the other one has got 300, just hit 300,000 views. So, in total, the images have been viewed about 750,000 times, which, like, completely blew my mind. I looked at it, I was just on Skype with one of my friends, I looked at it, and I was like, holy shit, this is fucking crazy. That's like the biggest impact I've ever had. So if you want to go and check out that set of random uh, power armor, then you can click the link in the description to go and see the coordinates and the armor. But today I've got a video of how you can get a guaranteed, like 100% guaranteed full set of X01 armor. Now, before we get into it, guys, this is going to be really quick. I've cut together the clips, so it's really quick. Before I get into it, you must, you must be at least... Level 25, I believe. When I went and got this power armor, I was level 27, so there you go. Um, a lot of people, if I've heard, if you go near an area, if you don't you don't have to go in it, if you go near it and spawn enemies there, then the, ar the armor that you get won't be the full set. You have to be at least 25, I believe it is. So, if you have not heard about this place, if you've never seen it or anything, make sure that you do not, do not go near it until you're at least level 25. Um, but I'm going to show you a quick walkthrough. Obviously, I've already gone and got the armor. Actually, in the video, I'm wearing the set of armor that you find. Um, so it won't be there when you see it, but I will, I'm going to walk you through how to get there. Um, also, guys, just quickly before I get into it, it's actually my birthday today, 8th of December 2015, and I'm 20. It's uh, kind of a bit weird to get my head around, but it is kind of cool. So we're going to get into this. I'm going to watch the video at the same time, just so I can fully explain to you what is going on. Um, oh, I did the wrong thing. So what you're seeing on the screen right now is where you need to go. So I'm starting at Sanctuary just because that's where I was. You need to go to the Custom, How uh, custom House Tower. Let me actually, let me go back and watch this quickly. What does it say? Yeah, Custom House Tower. That's what it is. Um, that is where you need to go, and then I'll walk you over to where I was. Basically, I got into a fight with some raiders. Um, they got in my way, and um, he takes it at the same time. But you're going you're to want to turn around from where you spawn in, turn around to face this old uh, little thing, the barricade with the protection in it, and then turn left, where you'll see a green, green building in front of you. And that is basically the building that you are going to want to go in. It says... Uh, 35 or court 35 on the front of it. I can't remember which one. I will show you in the video, but that is uh, basically where you need to go And there could be some enemies out here as you can see I've actually uh, as I said I've already gone into this area and there are enemies there. So um, Yeah, be aware that there will be enemies here. There are also laser turrets on the uh, uh, on the top of the door um, and they do quite a lot of damage. There you go, it says 35 quarts. So this is where you need to go in. The laser turrets do huge amounts of damage to me, even like as a level 40 plus character with like almost fully upgraded power armor, they took down like half my health. So basically you're gonna wanna go into 35 core and then this is where you're gonna find the power armor. Now, before you go in here, guys, as you can see, I'm showing it on the map, show it, showing it to you on the map. Basically guys, you are going to need to be fully suited out for this. If you wanna bring power armor, Fine, but you're going to need a lot of stim packs, you're going to need a lot of um, ammo, you're going to need some powerful weapons. I advise bringing a fat man, be careful with it obviously because close quarters. Um, but once you're inside the building, you're going to want to take the elevator as I show you. I actually had a lot of trouble in the elevator because I was trying to get Kate in the elevator and she just didn't want to go in. So eventually I went up and then she just spawned in there. The, the body system in Fallout is so freaking bugged. You're going to... I think uh, I think I cut out most of her just derping around, but hey. yeah, there you go. <laughs> I'm trying to get her to go in, and then she just stands there, she's a flipping idiot. So basically, when you go up the elevator, guys, you're gonna come out, and then you're gonna turn right. I'm gonna see a ramp going up, and as soon as you go up that ramp, or as soon as you get out of the elevator, I can't remember which one. 
Um, because I've already cleared it, you're going to see it in this video. But when you go out of the elevator to your right and up the ramp, there's going to be an Assaultron and a Sentry Bot that spawn in. And they do hella damage, especially the Sentry Bot. So that one you're going to need to be really careful with. But as you can see there, that is where the Power Armor is going to be. Now, it is guaranteed to be a full set. It, obviously, if you are level 25 or over, as I said, it will guaranteed be an XO1 armor. Now, I go into this little um, this little room here because I was like, oh, does nothing spawn? Um, and also, I'd never been in this room before. So, I go and pick up some junk. But basically, that is where the, um, the armor is in that little room. And the way that you get to it, as I should show you, um, but the sentry bot on the Assaultron come out on the either side of the armor which is in the middle and inside those pods where they come out of once you killed them there is a button in there you if you go into it you'll see it will say activate or e or whatever it is whatever console you're on so in this room as you can see now you go into that room both of them both sides you activate the button and that is it guys the doors will open and you get a set of x01 armor it's as simple as that now I've seen a couple of other guides, I've seen a couple of other posts of, of X01 locations, and there are quite a few in this game. There's one in an old um, pond, there's one out near um, Fort Strong, I believe it's called, um, the little place where you clear out the behemoth and the super mutants if you do the um, the Brotherhood story quest. It's right next to the Pridwin out on the uh, out on the bay. You will see it, you, you should know where it is. There's a place there, um, and I can cover all these places, guys, if you want me to. Um, there's another one down in the glowing sea, um, but these are not guaranteed. This is the only guaranteed set, um, but the other set that I did find in my imager post, or excuse me, <laughs> was um, was a pretty complete set. There was a chest, arm, and leg, I believe, which is the most amount I found. Uh, the only thing I'm uh, missing for Kate on her X01 armor is a right leg, which is quite annoying. But guys, that is the end of the video here. Um, I need to cut that bit out. But yeah, this is the end of the video here, guys. I hope you have enjoyed it. Um, this is a guaranteed set. Just remember, you have to be over level 25. I was level 27. So a lot of people saying, oh, you have to be level 30. You have to be level blah, blah, blah. I was level 27 when I got this. So it is guaranteed that if you are level 25 or over, you will get this set of armor. Um... So yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching. I'll post the link to my imager post uh, in the description. Thank you to everyone who went and looked at that image. It's like the craziest thing that I've ever seen. I blew up. I mean, I only made my, I, my imager account just to post like little funny things in the Fallout Reddit. I never expected it to just blow up like that. But I'll post that down for you in the description, guys. I hope you have enjoyed this video. Quick little guide. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> but uh, yeah, as always, my name is What's Night. Bye. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video.